progress. Hello, Ming. Is anything the problem? No. Oh, okay, I can hear you now. Hey, you sound tired. What happened? No, no, I'm not. Uh huh. Okay, so can you turn on the camera? Just quit me. Okay. Can you okay. hear me? Yeah, of course I can hear you. Okay. okay, oh, you're still using your mom's laptop? No, no, um, this is my new laptop. Oh, it's your new laptop. Okay, good to know that you have uh, your own laptop now. What happened to your PC? Uh, I think my PC is broken, so uh, I think it's in... Okay, so you, like, uh, what did the like me mechanics at the store tell you what 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 did the technicians at the laptop stores tell you can you say again oh uh, yeah i'm just asking about your pc you said that your pc was broken and last week you took it to the shop right you took your pc to the shop and i was just wondering what happened like at the shop what did the technicians tell you I think it, it takes a long it's overall over a week. So yeah, I cannot wait. So no, I think if I still use as PC, it's maybe yeah, broke again. So yeah, I would yeah, I would choose I would better choose a laptop because um, it may be more uh more uh, more complete yeah more complete um, it's, it's more complete and um, it may it may not broke my uh, PC and I can bring my 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 laptop to a everywhere I want yeah but the problem is that uh laptop your laptop is going to be very fragile very fragile rất là mỏng manh Okay. And another thing is that it is also very weak. It cannot contain a lot of heavy games. <laughs> not really, because my laptop I am using now is a gaming laptop. Always a gaming laptop. Okay, I see. How much yeah. did it cost? Uh, this is more expensive than the previous one. Mm -hmm. Like around. I choose around this Around 15, around 15 million? More. More than 15 million. Okay, around 20 then. More than 20? No, it's between uh, 15 and 12, 20. Okay, I see. Well, that is not that is not so bad, I guess, because it's a gaming laptop, right? <laughs> like... Yeah, because um, actually this, uh, because their, their facility is, you know, strong. And 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 it can use for a long time. If you use a uh, office laptop, um, the the efficiency is low, like my PC, mm -hmm. and 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 you cannot play any games or do anything like Photoshop or edit the video. Yes, yes, that's right. I I totally so agree. So two years. Yeah, because your main, I mean, the, let's say, uh, because the way you use your laptop is different from the other people, meaning that you use your laptop more than the average people, right? And yeah. the, the software that you are going to use on your laptop are much heavier than the ones like what that normal people use. Like, like me, yes. I only use uh, like very light software like uh, Excel, like some those belong to Microsoft, Zoom, and Skype, something like that. Those are the basic. It's just very basic. Well, can, I ask, can, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Do you see that my 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 webcam is lacking or or oh, still? It's smooth, still normal. Smoothing? It's still normal. Yeah, it's um, very smooth. Yes. And I don't know why. I 
I see your your webcam is really laggy and is I can still I I can clearly clearly hear you, but uh, ah. you move very like slow and <laughs> um, yeah I don't know why. I think it's maybe, because maybe. of connection. I think it's because of connection. I just read an article. It says that our cable is broken again. Okay. Yeah. But I don't know. I use. I when I watch YouTube or play games, I it's kind of smoothly. But I don't know why when we using when I using Zoom is so laggy. Yeah, that's the problem with Zoom. Like Zoom camera is not optimal. Nó không có tối ưu. Yeah, Zoom camera is not very optimal. Um, the main like the, the main purpose of Zoom is to to share the screen. Đúng không? Cái mục đích của Zoom là để share màn hình. Cho nên là những cái gì mà liên quan đến cái camera, ví dụ như camera quay trước như vậy thì tùy vào cái đường đường dẫn. Well, like the camera depends on the Uh, the connectivity, the connection of your house, of your web, of your Wi-Fi, and I think that uh, like the overall connection of Vietnam is having problem right now, so we cannot see each other very smoothly. <laughs> right, the pictures are not very smooth, but uh, it, it's okay. I, I can see you very clearly. I just hope that you don't feel um, how do you say, how do you say that you don't feel annoyed because of my picture. If you don't want to see my face, then just hide my face. Nếu như không muốn thấy mặt cô thì cứ giấu đi cũng được. No, no, no. I think can you like turn off and turn it on again? So maybe you can like restart the camera. Yeah. Okay. I already turned my camera off. Now let's try turning it on. Okay. <laughs> Does it make any difference? Does it make any difference uh, I, though? No, not really. No, not really. See, I told you it yeah. depends on the connection. Like, it has nothing to do with uh with like turning on uh, the camera on or off. Like because I'm still seeing you seeing your camera very smooth. Okay, so just just forget it. <laughs> yeah, just, just forget, forget it. it. Just forget it. Oh, uh, okay, Ming. I told you last week that I get like like you need to write a letter. Have you done it? Yes, yes. Uh, okay. Of course, I will send you. Okay, please send it to me and I'm going to correct it right now. Oh, okay. Wow. Um, okay, let's see. I'm going to use a whiteboard. And right here. Okay. Well, I did ask you to write it. Uh, I'll write it on Word, but it seems like you were you you prefer this uh, way. <laughs> Before you do yeah, I, 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 I won't write it on Word and Word, and then I copy it and paste it into the Zalo. Okay, uh, okay. okay, I see. Right. Okay, so I want to ask you something. Like, when you write this one, when, when you wrote this at home, uh, how much, like, how much did you use Google? How much did you use Google? around 10% em có sử dụng uh, cái uh, uh, Google dịch để để hỗ trợ cho bài viết này không? Well, of course I will use, I'm not really I just you know, um, like a, a dictionary and then I find the synonym of that word. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, my... Right, thank you. Right, so the first thing you need to write is to, is uh, like a greeting. Okay, you got it to the editor. Right. Um, so if you read if you read the question I gave you, uh, it says that it asks you to write an email to the editor, đúng không? Right. Chỗ này thì mình uh, có thể bịa ra một cái tên cũng được. Ví dụ như mình đó là to Miss Zara. Sau đó là editor of cái magazine nào đó. Được chưa nào? Right. Thì bây giờ mình đưa một cái từ the editor này thôi thì mình uh, kiểu không biết được cái cái người editor này là ai, editor của cái gì. Đúng không? Right. Next time try to be more creative. Uh, give give this person a name. You can think of any name and give them a position. If I were you, I would write to Miss Zara, editor of uh how to say Summer's magazine, something like that. Okay. Editor of Summer magazine. Phải. Rồi sau đó là mình xuống dòng, okay. À, cái phần chào hỏi này khá là quan trọng. 
à, nó sẽ cho một người đọc biết được là mình đang gửi thư đến ai và người đó có chức vụ như thế nào ok và bởi vì mình đang viết một cái lá thư trang trọng cho nên thì mình cũng phải tôn trọng cái đối phương cho họ một cái tên và một cái chức vụ đàng hoàng ok I am writing to give a prop a proposition what is this mean what does this mean I I use that word in the uh the word uh, in the previous lesson yeah the, 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 they are saying that I am writing to put my forward uh, to put forward my proposal so proportion I think It's ah normal. proposition okay i i understand that what i'm just asking you to see if you really understand that right if you use google, google translate to help you might not be able to remember it if you did like a little bit research on the word you see that it has like almost the same meaning with the word proposal okay right i am writing to give a proposition about a celebrity who can be a good model for young people good Okay, first question, very perfect. <laughs> no, no, not very perfect, absolutely perfect. I would like Thanks. to invite, okay, I would like to invite Elon Musk. And okay, so right here, you made a mistake. Uh, entrepreneur, you see the word entrepreneur is start with letter E, right? It start with letter E. Nó đang được viết uh, bắt đầu bằng chữ cái là chữ cái E, một trăm năm chữ cái nguyên âm của bạn chữ cái tiếng Anh. Oh. Right, so. At this point, you should be using an, not a, right? Okay, so this is an, oh no. Yeah, this is what happened when you, and this is what happened when you try to correct a word. Okay, no worries. Right, I'm an entrepreneur. Okay, từ này rất là khó đọc, entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. That's right, okay. I would like to invite Elon Musk, an entrepreneur, investor, and businessman, magnate, magnate, is it? Magnate or manager? Yes, magnate. Okay, this is the first time I've seen this word, a okay, new word for me. What does it mean? Uh, I don't really know, but personally, magnate means like, uh, like a manager, as you know, but it's more higher and... I, I just found it uh, I, I just like uh found the information or such information about him in Wikipedia mm -hmm. and they say that he is an investor and president magnate right okay because, because I think not only and he he's not only a billionaire he's an investor or and or more Okay, I will have to check the meaning of the word magnet later and I can't uh, like I can't manage to open another web right now. It's going to make my laptop run slower and it's going to be difficult for you to look at my face. So I'm going to remember remember that word later, business magnate. Okay, new word. Okay, uh, an investor and business magnet to give them a source of inspiration. Good, right. Do not read this word at, as inspiration, okay? It is inspiration inspiration good inspiration elon musk has been a billionaire okay when he was 14 he is now a founder okay right here another mistake two two corporation see okay S. that's right be S. careful okay all right two corporations um okay cái chỗ này em ghi đúng là co the, the, the corporation Kiểm tra lại cho cô là co này đằng sau chữ o này nó có r không nhá. Không không. Đằng kiểu như là cô cô nhớ là nó phải như vậy nhưng mình không không biết nữa. I forgot. No, no. Okay. No. CO2 big corporation Tesla and SpaceX. Musk is the wealthiest of the of the oh. world or the world. <cười> okay. Mistake there. Okay. According to both the Bloomberg Billionaires Index and the Forbes Real Time Billionaire List, good. Behind that, successful. Okay, so you see here, you use the word that, right? So after that, it should be a noun. Đúng không? After that, it should be a noun, right? Bởi vì that nó giống như là cái người là cái từ để gọi this girl, that boy, đúng không? Thì đằng sau that mình gọi là một danh từ. So it's successful a noun. 
No, it's an actor. No, it's an adjective. <laughs> successful is an adjective. Uh, an Successfully adjective. is an, an adverb. Okay, so you should use success here only. Okay? Behind that success, he has had to... Yeah, he has had to overcome many failure to reach the top of the mountain. Good. When he was a child, his... Okay, what is this? Another new word for me. Okay, adenoid. This mean a, a, a problem of uh, like an ear, in ear, that it makes you, like, make you hardly to hear. Uh, oh, okay. Sound, yeah. Okay, okay. It, right. it can lead you to death. It can lead you to death. Okay, I don't know. Okay, I'm looking for it. A disease about of the ear. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! No, 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 no! Like I just, I, I just had to like Oxford Dictionary on my phone, but like they, they, they forced me to pay. Kind of annoying. Right, one moment. I have to see what it is. Thank you for explaining to me. Uh, right, the small soft pieces of flesh at the top of your throat, behind your nose, that sometimes becomes swollen. Okay. Nó đang bảo là cái gì đó liên quan đến throat và nose cơ mà. Học học như thế đúng không? Thì nó À, cái vòng họng. Is that right? Cái vòng họng. I don't know. Cái tay mũi họng thì cũng hơi rồi rồi cô hiểu rồi cái mũi họng nó nối với nhau sau đó nó có một cái chỗ gọi như là cái đường thông nó có một cái ngã ba ở đấy thì cái adenoid nó nằm ở đấy ok thank you right when he was a child his adenoids were removed because doctors suspected that he was deaf uh -huh. but his mother later decided that he was thinking in another world right so can you explain this to me in Vietnamese like his mom later decided that he was thinking in another world like he is like uh... He think he just you know, think like he thinks differently, like, right? Is that right? Yeah, think differently for other people. Ah, uh, okay. You can you can use another way to express this instead of saying he was thinking in another world because when I read the sentence of yours, I imagine that uh his mom was thinking that uh must was in another world and that time he was thinking about something. Tức là ở một thế giới khác uh, Must sẽ suy nghĩ cái điều gì đó Chứ không phải là must suy nghĩ khác người Được không nào Ok Mình có thể xài cái Mình có thể xài sự như sau uh, He was He got one người He um, later decided that He had a different mind Đúng không Ok He had a different mind Ok Zip2 is the first company that must have found it. Okay, so remember you are telling his backstory. So remember to put it in the verb, the, the past tense, right? Okay. Okay, Zip2 was the first, was the first company that must have found it. Then Compact acquired Zip. Okay. Ooh, good. There are a number of contents about, about how his billionaire achieved. How this billionaire achieve? Okay, you like em đánh vần sai chưa achieve nè. <laughs> achieve his goal. My suggestion are as follows: How he perform? As follow này thì em sẽ để cái hai dấu chấm ở đây để cho dấu hai chấm ở đây này. Cho để người ta biết có cái dấu hai chấm để người ta dừng lại để người ta lấy hơn người ta đọc tiếp. My suggestion for cái này là nói đề bài nó yêu cầu gì nhỉ? For, uh, What, what does the, the, the yeah. test ask you? I test ask you that uh, like a magazine is published an article about uh, oh, uh, okay. a, a man or a woman who will be yeah, good yeah, model yeah, yeah. for young people. Yeah, I see. So the contents, right? You were talking about the contents. Right, okay. Vậy thì mình đang gợi ý nội dung cho bài viết đúng nhỉ? Right, vậy thì em có thể nói là my suggestion for the for the article tức là cho cái bài báo để cho gợi ý cho cái bài báo my suggestion for the article are as follows okay how he performs his dream to space right 
cái này là biến ước mơ đi vào vũ trụ thành hiện thực đúng không nhỉ? Ok, ok. You can say fulfill. Do you know this word? Ok, how he, how he fulfill his, his dream of coming to space, of going to space. Ok, uh, did, did, uh, did Elon Musk used to work at NASA? No, he not. He, he wants to buy a uh, he, he's he really like to go to space and especially mars so uh, he told that when he was a millionaire he was trying asking russian to buy their rocket their, their, their rocket to uh, to buy the rocket to go to go to space, uh -huh. but they refuse. They refuse. And then he, he, he feel annoyed. So that's the reason why he, he found a country, a a corporation called Space. Okay, so let's sum it up because your your sentences were a little bit messy. So, yes. Elon Musk never worked at nasa right never worked at nasa yes he just liked the rocket and he just wanted to go to the space that's why he asked the the russian to to sell their rocket to him yes uh-huh so did he come to, did he go to space himself or did he send other people to go to space um yeah he, he, want, he like he liked a rocket actually and uh and and uh he want to send it to space to like give the world that human can live in mars mm -hmm. like you see that they he almost has um, made a lot of recycle recycle rocket that it can use uh it can use many times mm -hmm. Okay, so, I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to trying to figure out if he had come to space or not. Cô chỉ muốn hỏi là xem ông đây có đến vũ trụ bao giờ chưa hay là kiểu uh, chỉ phóng tên lửa lên thôi. No, not yet. Okay. No, not yet. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay, so this might not be true, right? This might not be true. How he fulfills his dream of going to space. Đúng không? Làm thế nào để anh ta đạt được cái giấc mơ mà đi vào vũ trụ, đi vào không gian? Là vậy thì cái người đàn ông này chưa đi vào không gian bao giờ, đúng không? Wait, wait, I would say it's not going to, like, he dream to uh, oh, you... to Mars. To Mars. Okay, to Mars. Okay, but I'm going to I'm going to leave it here. Okay, check your information one more time and, and uh, fix it at home, okay? Okay, how he learned from his experiences on how to deal with life changes. Okay, rồi, nếu như mà experience nó đếm được và nó đưa, đưa về số nhiều như vậy, thì sẽ là trải nghiệm, trải nghiệm tức là sao? Đến đâu đó lần là lần đầu tiên, đến đâu đó lần thứ hai, đến đâu đó lần đầu cũng như lần cuối. Nó là trải nghiệm, right? Là những cái việc mà mình làm một lần, làm hai lần ở những nơi mà mình chưa bao giờ mình đến. Đó thì gọi là trải nghiệm. Thì ở đây cô nghĩ là mình đang muốn nói về kinh nghiệm cho nên cô sẽ xóa cái S đi. Right. How he learns from his experience on how to deal with life changes. Good. How to overcome obstacles. Okay. Chỗ này là mình nè. Cô thêm cái chữ fulfills và chữ learn. Cô thêm S vào nhé. Bởi vì ở đây mình đang xài cái công thức là đạo ngữ. Được chưa? Mình xài công thức đạo ngữ. Bởi vì những cái từ là how nè. Right. Là những từ để hỏi đúng không? Và mình để ý thấy trong câu hỏi ấy, nó sẽ là how does sau đó cộng với chủ ngữ. Nhưng mà đây không phải là câu hỏi nữa. Cho nên là cái does đó nó biến thành cái s đằng sau cái cái động từ. Mình chưa nào? Okay. I am assured that. Okay. Um, so remember assured is a verb. Assured is a verb. And a verb cannot stand with to be. Động từ không được phép đi với to be. Được chưa? Có thể là minh lộn là cái assure này là tính từ nhưng mà không phải. Chỗ này sửa thành can cho cô để đổi, đổi thành động từ khiếm khuyết. Được chưa nào? Yeah, I can assure that Elmer's guidance would have a positive impact on young people. Được chưa nào? Rồi. 
impact on để lại cái cái tác động gì đó lên giới trẻ vậy thì mình sẽ phải xài on kẻ có tác động lên giới trẻ lên người trẻ who are just going out of the nest uh -huh. and I strongly believe that others people should be in uh, should be on my side chưa? should be on my side one more thing chỗ này là others mà mình thêm s tức là nó đã bao gồm chữ people trong đấy rồi others mà có s thì không cần people còn nếu như mà order không có s mới cần có people ha right good okay so i'm going to copy this and i'm going to send you in your chat okay right okay so overall you did a very good job telling like like Uh, completing the requirements of the of the question. Rồi mình đã làm rất tốt trong cái việc mà hoàn thành cái yêu cầu của đề bài là giới thiệu một người trẻ, muốn vào một người mà kiểu như là có thể trở thành tấm gương sáng. Um, nhưng mà đọc kỹ lại cái đề giúp cô nha là nó đang kêu là ở nước mình hay ở nước ngoài. Rồi ở đây thì nó không có nói nước nào cả cho nên là mình vừa nói về Elamus vẫn hoàn toàn chính xác được rồi tốt bố cục thì mình đang rất là tuân thủ với bố cục mà cô chỉ đầu tiên là có cái lời chào hỏi thứ hai là có cái phần mà uh, nêu cái nội dung mình muốn nội dung chung đúng không nêu cái nội dung lý do viết bức thư này và sau đó là mình giải thích cho cái lý do đó được chưa rồi và cuối cùng là lời kết có chính xác rồi có vừa có kết mà vừa có gợi ý nữa hay okay, rất là một cái bài rất là đầy đủ kia cho Okay, so if if this was if if this were an uh, like an IELTS test, you might got a really high score for this, around 7.5 for writing. This looks only about yeah, it can be six point. It's only like five point point five no. or yeah. no, no actually. Trust me, because I got 7.5 on, on writing and I could clearly see that this could be around 7 or 7.5. I have, I have read many like uh, writing, um, uh, writing uh, class of uh, IELTS and I see that they use, they use more, more, more professional. More and more advanced and, words, right? Um, yeah, I, don't, yes. I, don't think, I don't think that's all to, to writing. Right. Aside from aside from using like advanced word and formal words, you need you need a connection, right? You need a really good connection. You need coherence, coherence. Tức là sao cái sự mạch lạc trong cái lối viết văn của mình. Okay, and I can clearly see that in your writing here. You did a very good job. Um, okay, you you have a begin, you have an opening, you have a good ending, right? You also uh like everything is connected quite good mọi thứ đều được kết nối với nhau một cách khá là chắc chắn có một cái uh, có một cái chỗ ngay cổ khúc này thôi là cô thấy nó chưa có được mặt lạc lắm nè tự dưng đang nói về uh, về cái việc mà adenoid gì đó được uh, lấy ra khỏi cơ thể bởi vì uh, bác sĩ nghi ngờ rằng anh ấy sẽ uh, anh ấy sẽ bị điếc đúng không rồi sau đó tự dưng lại có lô cái zip two là cái công ty gì đó thì nó hai cái chuyện hai cái vật này nó không có liên quen nó thiếu cái sự kết nối Vậy thì mình cần một cái ý nữa để nối vào cái cái câu này Để làm cho nó mượt hơn một chút xíu Còn nhìn chung là rất là ổn rồi à, Nhìn chung nó rất là ổn okay, I got a 7.5 on writing And I have to say I'm very impressed with your writing See? You, you, yeah, yeah you, you should be more confident with wish, your writing I, I wish that I could have a, a 6.5 Okay. So last time, how how much did you get last time? How much did you get? Oh, yes, I, I'm really lazy on writing, so so yeah. Don't tell, uh, don't so tell me you, you you didn't finish everything in writing. Viết không xong đúng không? Ý là viết không xong hay là không kịp thời gian? Ý cô đang hỏi vậy. No, like I lazy on it when I'm. I'm not lazy on writing, but I, when if when whenever I have a homework about writing, I try to do it uh, my best. Yeah. So, so maybe because you were you were lazy at the time and that you didn't pay much attention to the writing, that's why you got low mark. Mm -hmm. But I I I trust your ability. I trust your ability. Uh, I have seen some of my students. They had very good writing, but they couldn't. 
uh, impress me as much as you did because you use words that even I don't understand, like magnet, ad, ad, adenoids, right? And right, the, mm, the way you connect everything to your story, the way you connect your story was very good. Okay, I understood most of it. It's just that there was one mistake right here. It's not a mistake. It's like uh, uh, an, an error that could be fixed. Đúng không? Đây sẽ là một cái lỗi mình có thể sửa được bằng cách là xem lại cái cái thứ tự viết của mình, xem lại cái thứ tự các cái nội dung của mình. Trong văn viết của IELTS thì nó đề cao cái gì? Đề cao tính mặt lẻ. Đúng không? Đề cao tính mặt lẻ. Và uh, những cái yếu tố như là từ vựng và ngữ pháp nó chỉ là cái phần thêm vào để nó quyết định thôi. Đúng chứ? Chứ bây giờ mà mình viết, mình viết một cái bài văn mà chả có mở đầu, chả có kết thúc, chỉ có mỗi cái đoạn giữa thôi thì nó còn gì là mặt lạc đâu. Right. Okay. Nó không có cái sự kết nối gì cả, không có một tí xíu mặt lạc nào cả. Thì viết văn như vậy thì có sử dụng cái từ cao cấp hay là ngữ pháp cao cấp đi chăng nữa thì cũng cũng không được. Đó, cũng không được điểm cao. ok Một cái bài văn rõ ràng, dễ hiểu, người ta nhìn vô, người ta đọc, người ta thấy thích là người ta sẽ rất có cảm tình và dễ cho điểm cao. Right. You did it. Ok. Good. Right. Thank you so much. I have sent you the correction that, that I just did right now. Okay. Remember to copy it into your work file. Okay. Right. Um, okay. Can you wait a moment? I need to check something. Um, I think last time we finished. Okay. Last time we finished the writing. Đúng chưa? Lần trước mình đã học xong cái phần bài writing rồi. Thì bây giờ mình sẽ học thêm hai buổi ôn tập nữa. Thì sau đó là mình sẽ làm cái bài kiểm tra nhé. Được chưa nào? We have some tests to do. Okay. Now, can you see the screen of review unit one? Yes. Okay. So in the first review, you're going to focus mostly on vocabulary and word skills. Okay. In the next uh, next part, you're going to focus on grammar. Right. Okay. Now let's do exercise one. Choose the correct answer from A to C to complete the sentences. Okay. You have six sentences right here. Right. Number one. What is your answer? A, B, or C? What exercise? Uh, Again, okay. the exercise number one here. Okay, sentence one. Your screen is like lucky, so I can. Oh, okay. I'm so sorry. Okay. Can you can you see can you see number one right here? Yeah. Yes. 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 Okay. If you can see it, then good. Then it's good. Uh, one is B. B. Right. B. Right. How do you read yeah, this word? Eccentric. Okay, eccentric. What does it mean? It's like very weird. <laughs> very weird, very sure? strange. Good. That's why right. very weird, very strange. Good. Right? You can see that they describe uh, her, her aunt's like she wears really weird clothes. Here, we have the word weird right here. Okay, two. So, um, A, B, or C? B. B, okay, you said B. Right, so why not A or C? What is A? Stingy, what is A? A? It's stingy is in the negative meaning. Yeah, stingy has a negative meaning. Good. And C, it has positive or negative meaning? Positive. Positive. And B also is a positive word. But how, like, what makes you choose B but not C? <laughs> As a word passionate, passion, passion is mean that you are, have a passion of something. Mm -hmm. But I, like the, okay, okay. So passionate is that you have a passion for something, but can, if you put it in here, it, does it like, does it fit the context? Does it fit the context? Passionate is like you have, you are really passionate about your PC. Okay, if I talk about PC and gaming, you can talk for like one hour nonstop. That is passionate. Okay, so passionate is not the correct option here. Remember that. Uh, my answer for this should be considerate. Can you say it? Considerate. Considerate. Good. Considerate is like you show you show the other people that you care about them. Okay, you show that you care about them. Okay, so in this sentence. Someone is thanking another person for waiting for them. 
Okay, so if you come to class earlier than I do, I will say thank you for waiting. It was really considerate of you, right? À, cái điều mà bạn vừa làm thực sự rất là rất là đẹp, rất là cảm kích. Cho tôi rất là cảm kích cái điều bạn vừa làm. Okay, và considerate này là, là bày tỏ thái độ quan tâm. Còn cái passionate là đam mê. Just like I told you, if you talk about PC and gaming, you can talk for one hour nonstop. Okay, but and stingy, stingy is like um stingy is like you have money you don't want to use your money on anything for anyone like uh like your friends your friends treat you to milk tea sometime but you never treat them back right three quiet uh, see C, shrewd, shrewd. shrewd, that's right, shrewd, good shrewd, job. Shrewd. Good, shrewd is the correct answer. Okay, I'm going to explain the other two. Critical, critical is like you judge everything a lot. Okay, so before you buy a PC, you tend to be very critical, right? Okay, you need to consider it between either this PC is better or the other PC is better. Okay, so that is critical. Selfless, is like you care about the others too much that you forget yourself. Okay, you'd rather sacrifice yourself for the others. That is called selfless. And truth, truth is like you have a very uh, smart, uh, you have a very clever mind. You have a very clever mind. You think ahead of the others. Mình tính toán trước cả người khác luôn. Okay. Number four. Uh, so... Uh, hey, hey, I guess I guess okay, vein is the vein is the only option that is acceptable yeah. here. Why? What is cruel? Cruel is evil. Uh -huh, cruel is evil. Bad. Uh, okay. Affectionate. I don't really understand this word. Um, affectionate. You can you can connect the word affectionate with love, care, and consideration. For example, affectionate is like you have a little brother, right? And your brother really likes you. He always hugs you and tell tell you how much he loves you. That means he's being affectionate. Okay, like shows a lot of love. It's different from be from considerate. Considerate is showing a lot of care. Like, chỉ là quan tâm thôi. Còn cái affectionate là bày tỏ lòng yêu thương cơ. Right. Okay. So, maybe A is the only correct word right here. Uh, right. Someone who is vain is too proud of their good look, abilities, or position. Okay. That is vain. Another meaning of vain. Right. Good. Next five. Um, sympathetic women who uh. die, they just laugh. Okay, okay, good, good, good. Sympathetic, right? Good. Next number six. Mm -hmm. Stubborn. I mean, you're so stubborn. Good, good. This, this one is stubborn. That is the correct answer. Very good. What is spontaneous? Okay, spontaneous. Okay, meaning that you do things without thinking too much. Okay, you do things without thinking too much. You like your mind is like, okay, let it go, let it go. All right. Let be free, let your mind be free. That is spontaneous. Một cách vô cùng tự nhiên thoải mái không có màng đến cái cái chắc trở hay là cái ngăn cấm nào cả spontaneous cứ tự nhiên thôi right so for example if you visit your friend's house right uh, and you you act like you're at your own house is that is you're being spontaneous okay? but if you if you go visit your friend's house and you uh, you are too afraid to do anything okay? you're not spontaneous at all right Complete the sentence with compound adjectives form from the words below. <laughs> okay. 
Right. Okay. Compound adjective, compound adjective là tính từ ghép. Ở đây nó cho mình một cái từ gốc, cái đề này khó nè. Nó cho một cái từ gốc, mình sẽ phải sử dụng cái từ gốc đấy. Biến đổi làm sao nó ra được một cái tính từ ghép. Và tính từ ghép là như thế nào? Là sự kết hợp của hai tính từ với nhau. Rồi bài này cô sẽ hỗ trợ mình làm. Nobody in my family likes visiting my grandfather. He's really. Ở đây thì theo mình có chữ nào có thể mô tả được cái tính cách của ông này nhỉ? Nếu như mà cả gia đình mình đều không thích đi thăm ông nội. Bởi vì ông nội như thế nào? Ông nội nóng tính, ông nội khó chịu đúng không? Thì có cái từ nào nó mô tả được ông nội nóng tính khó chịu nhỉ? À, mình sẽ mình sẽ nhớ đến cái chữ mà chữ mà temper đúng không mình sẽ bắt nguồn từ cái chữ temper mình có một cái chữ như sau đó là ill temper do you know this word do you know this word no. okay temper temper mình do you know the word temperature Okay, temperature là nhiệt độ đúng không? Like the higher the temperature, the hotter it gets. Rồi vậy thì ở đây mình sử dụng đến cái chữ temper là để một cách ẩn dụ đến cái cái tính cách của một người. Right, ill temper, ill là bị ốm này đúng không? Hay là kiểu như là bị mắc bệnh, không có vấn đề gì, có vấn đề gì đó. Còn temper là nói về cái nhiệt độ mà nhiệt độ của mình càng cao thì người đó càng càng nóng tính đúng không? Nhiệt độ mà càng thấp thì kiểu như người đó càng càng là lạnh lẽo. Vậy thì đây ill temper là nói về những cái người mà tính khí thất thường đúng không nào? Rồi, ok. Tại ill temper nhờ một uh, vì ông nội có một cái tính khí vô cùng thất thường cho nên là cả nhà chả thích à, chả thích đến chơi với ông cả. Rồi, I'm quite gì đó, so I don't usually get upset if people are rude to me. Mindless. Mindless. Have you ever seen the word open-minded? <cười> Uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, no, no, but that is not the word. No, 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 that is not the word right here. Uh, câu này mình sẽ sử dụng chữ go. Mình có nhớ từ dễ dãi là gì không nhỉ mình nhỉ? Từ dễ tính. Uh, outgoing is like, oh, I enjoy the outside world. I love going outside. That is outgoing. Có một chữ nó bắt đầu bằng go luôn. Không phải bắt đầu bằng go mà có chữ go ở trong đó luôn. Nhưng mà là chỉ cái tính cách dễ dàng. Anything is fine to me. Easy. Easy going. Ah, easy going. Okay, easy going. Đúng không? Easy going là rất là thoải mái, rất là dễ tính. Anything is fine. Right. Next, those, ch those children are very good behavior. Good behavior is a noun. Nó là một cái danh từ ghép, đúng không? Danh từ ghép là bao gồm một tính từ đứng trước một danh từ. Còn ở đây tính từ ghép là bao gồm hai tính từ cho cô. Đó, còn uh, mình mình xài cái chữ, uh, chữ chữ behave là đúng rồi đó. Rồi, mình có well well, well, behave. Behave. well, well behave. Đúng rồi, well behave. Right. Rồi, kiểu như là rất là cư xử, rất là ngoan ngoãn nè, well behave. Rồi, tiếp tục, chúng ta có câu số 4. My parents never judge people. They are fair. Never judge people. Không có, không có xét đoán gì khác. Okay, so uh, so the, I can give you a hint, like um, uh, like so na nowadays LGBT is being a, is a very big is a very big issue, right? LGBT is a very big issue, right? So some parents think that LGBT is bad, but some parents think that LGBT is good. Okay, so those who think uh those who think LGBT is good, what do we call them in Vietnamese? Những cái người mà có cái đầu óc mà chấp nhận cái chuyện LGBT đấy thì mình gọi họ là những người có đầu óc như thế nào nhỉ? Crazy. No, not crazy. They're very open-minded. Oh, open-minded. Open-minded, oh, đúng không? Rồi, suy nghĩ thoáng, được chưa? Suy nghĩ rất là thoáng. Rồi, okay, open-minded, suy nghĩ thoáng. Rồi, chúng ta đã xong được mấy từ rồi. Còn câu 5, câu 6. She, she studies for hours every night. She's very hardworking. Hard hardworking. That's right. Đây là một tính từ ghép. Thấy chưa? Okay, next. Nothing seemed to bother my friend. Okay, so I have another word for this. 
it, uh, cái này nó giống cái này nó giật tiếng Việt nó có từ y chang luôn ấy. So if a guy wants to date a girl, right? He confess his feelings to that girl so many times, but that girls always reject him. Okay? Right. He confess, he fell, he confess again, he fails again. And people outside are calling him are calling him mặt gì? Huh? Uh, mặt gì? Uh, mặt gì? Đúng rồi, mặt dày thì nó sẽ liên quan đến chữ nào ở trong đây? Skin. Skin, đúng rồi. Dày. Thick skin. No, thick. <cười> thick skin, được chưa? Yes, thick, thick skin. Thick skin, đó. Rồi, cô sẽ chụp lại cái bài này cho mình để mình xem lại nhé. Tại vì cái này có vẻ như mình không có biết đến nhiều tân dân từ ghép, à, tấn tử ghép lắm. Rồi, đây, cái thick skin là da dày thì tiếng Việt mình cũng có cái từ dịch tương tự đó là mặt dày theo cái kiểu người mà chay chay lì không đời nào chịu từ bỏ ấy. Rồi, được chưa? Okay, this is not too difficult, but I hope that you have if you have time, please review that for me. Right, thank you. Okay. Do you have any question? No. No, okay, that's good. Okay. Um, do you have a, a class after this? Yes. Okay. If you have class after this, I'm going to send you the homework so that you can complete it for me. Okay. Um, okay. So I will send you this paper. We still have three, four, five, six, and seven. We haven't done. Okay. So that is your homework for the ne uh, for the next week. Okay. I already set my alarm for Wednesday, so don't expect me to forget. I will never forget Wednesday. <laughs> right. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much for coming here today. I will see you again on Wednesday. Have a nice weekend. Okay. Bye-bye. Thank you.